What is going on, everybody? Thank you for tuning in to another edition of On the Road to Victory. I am your host, Jimmy Smith, and it's game day, baby. So I appreciate you taking the time here. We are not live. This is a recording. Want to give you the practice squad elevations and depth charts for today. Usually these are on Saturday before the Sunday, but for some reason, Monday night games, you're allowed to do it at four o'clock the same day. So we're going to take a look at the practice squad elevations for both teams, the updated depth charts. And then before the game, we'll see the inactives, a couple of questionable people, but we'll see how telling these elevations are. But let's jump right into it. Appreciate each and every one of you taking the time, hitting that like button, all the things you're doing to support the channel. But let's jump right into this with the Eagles practice squad elevations. Devin Allen getting his first NFL action. I know a lot of you are going to be excited about that. We talked about this throughout the week. Made a post earlier today. Could this be a possibility with the Eagles not having either of their kick returners? Well, it looks like that's the case. And as you can see, the game status report, if you missed it the other day, here it is. Two people out for the Eagles. The rest, everybody good to go. Boston Scott, Quez Watkins out. So no kick returners. And we also don't have a punter. So the Eagles go ahead and elevate Braden Mann, the punter, and Devin Allen, the Olympic a hurdler, I guess, not a sprinter, but he's fast as shit. So let's see how he does in the kick return game. Like to see a little spark there. If he fails, maybe you see Rashad Penny, but got some wide receiver depth. Doubt he plays any uh, snaps there, but uh, need Alameda Zacchaeus to step up there, but could see him back there. Kick returner, so fantastic. Now, let's take a look at this updated depth chart. If you're looking for any of these names, here are the guys that are on reserves here. IR for Bradley, Dean, Johnson, Maddox, and McPherson. And then, of course, Rogers suspended. So if you're looking for any of those names, that's why they're not here. Now, let's take a gander at this. You see Boston Scott, Quez Watkins out. Now, Devin Allen there in parentheses because he is a practice squad addition. So you have another slot receiver, a guy that, you know, probably, again, not going to play too much offense. But uh, if you need, you got somebody there. Now, Anybody else in green is new to the team, as always. So if you're wondering what the green is there, but the red, that means they are out. On defense here, hilarious. I didn't change his back, but you know I had James Bradbury in here as nickel corner, and I had Josh Job as the other outside corner. Then the media told us that uh, they were they were promised that uh, Bradbury would never play nickel corner, and then it was reported today that they are wrong as usual. So what I told you uh, over a week ago, a couple of weeks ago, that James Bradbury could be at nickel, sounds like that was the correct thing. So he looks like he'll be starting there, but no injuries, so let's F and go. Now, both of these elevations help us. As you can see, Braden Man new to the team here, punter and holder. We're going to see how he does. And then Devin Allen helping us as a kick returner with Scott and Watkins both out there. So, look, I'd love to see a spark in this return game. We need it, so whatever gets the job done there. But that is what the Eagles will look like for tonight's game. No questionable uh, tags there. Now, different story for the Buccaneers. So sorry, dude. My hair, everything's all crazy. I had a long day getting all kinds of tests and stuff done. But uh, bear with me here. And don't worry. I will be live later for the pregame show. This is just to keep you updated with everything that's going on for the game. Now, let's take a look at the elevations for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and First, I'll show you the game status report in case you missed it, but Kansi and Servaccia Dennis already listed as out. So we know they're out, but you've got questionable here. Carlton Davis, Vita Vey, Cody Malk, and Devin White. Some pretty serious names there, so we'll be keeping our eye out for that news for sure. But maybe we can gather some information here. Now, linebacker J.J. Russell was elevated, as well as Deidrin Sanat there, the defensive lineman. So... We can take a look at their depth chart and try to see what's going on here. Now, if you're looking for any of their names, here are their reserves list. Only guys on IR, Chase Edmonds, Russell Gage, and Ryan Jensen. Nothing else going on, but there are your reserve players. Now, on offense, anybody in orange, new to the team. Everybody in white has been on this roster. Now, if you see gray with a Q tag, that is questionable. So you see on offense, their right guard, Cody Malk, questionable for this game. Other than that, everyone else good to go there on offense. Then on the defensive side of the ball is where you have a lot of question marks. So we know Kalijah Kansi's out. 
Now, Vita Vey is questionable. So you bring a guy like Deidrin Sanat, who can play some nose tackle. He is a versatile defensive lineman, more of a big boy. But uh, look, you've got some injuries there. So that's a no-brainer for them. Now, also at linebacker, you've got Devin White questionable. Servaccia Dennis is out. So regardless of a Devin White plan or not, you need some depth there. So they bring up J.J. Russell. Now, we talked about Carlton Davis questionable. If he is out, Zion McCollum will get another start. His twin brother on the Eagles practice squad, Tristan McCollum. So, look, they've got some injuries. They will be looking uh, for some answers here if uh, anybody is out. But uh, as you can see, nothing wrong with the special teams game for them so they're good to go there but uh that is it ladies and gentlemen those are the practice squad elevations for the eagles and buccaneers week three monday night football matchup with the updated depth charts would love to hear your thoughts on this how do you think Devin Allen's going to do? Braden, man, whatever's on your mind. Maybe you're a Buccaneers fan. You want to tell me about JJ Russell, Deidre Sinat, whatever is on your mind. I would love to hear it, but I'll be back later live around I would say 6-ish, uh, yeah, around 6, 6.30-ish, going to try to make this live video pregame show, baby. Maybe we'll have some more answers then. Hope to see you then, but I hope you're having a great day, getting excited for some Eagles football. But until next time, I'm Jimmy Smith, and this is On the Road to Victory. You all have a great day. Try to stay sane in the next few hours here. And as always, say it with me now. Go Birds!